And more fallout tonight from Northwestern's agreement with protesters on campus. The Jewish United Fund wrote a letter to the university's president. Terrence Lee spoke with the person who wrote it. He's at the live desk now with some of their conversation. Yeah, I have a copy of the letter right here from the Jewish United Fund. It's slamming the university for going along with several of the protesters' demands. Chicago's Jewish Federation saying the administrators should not have embraced, quote, those who frequently disrupted Northwestern's academics and flouted those policies. The university's president defended the agreement while condemning anti-Semitism in a video released Tuesday. But JUF's executive vice president says the message was tone deaf and didn't address any of the concerns of Jewish students and faculty who he says feel Northwestern doesn't have their backs. That has nothing to do with who's wrong or who's right in the Middle East conflict. It's about the right of any student, regardless of their identity, to feel they have a safe place on their campus. University has their back. And when they are demonized, taunted, and intimidated, university will come to their aid. He says he hasn't heard back from the school yet, but if he were to, he hopes leadership says they won't give in to the protesters' demands, they end relationships with Israeli universities, or adjust investments to exclude companies doing business in Israel.